welcome back. For those who do not know me, my name is Alexis. I'm the face behind Naughty Dreams. And this week, I don't really have anything planned. So I figured, let's make a fun video. I have gotten four crochet books. I have Hooked on Amigurumi from Melanie Morita. Oh, Not Too Shabby Crochet, that's who it's from. And then I have Mama Made Minis Knotted Lovies. And then I have Unicorns and Dragons, the first and the second book. I haven't bought the third one yet, but that one is coming. I just need to start making patterns out of my books instead of just collecting books. So let's make a fun video. I am going to look through these books and see what patterns like I want to do the most. I know I want to do the unicorns and dragons. I just know it would probably take me a long time. So honestly, I think it might be this one and I might see how many patterns in this book I can get done in a week. Not technically a week because today is Wednesday and I upload on Tuesdays. So I don't know. Let's see how many I can get done. I will surf through them. Uh, there is 40 patterns in here, so I doubt I can even probably get half, but a lot of them seem really simple. Um, like here's the table of contents and I'll focus. That is all of the patterns in the book. There are a crap ton. The sections are beach, Bums, Once Upon a Time, Eat Your Heart Out, Bento Box, Sip, Sip, Hooray, and this one's just the basics for like tools and materials. So honestly, I think I might start with the Eat Your Heart Out and just get a crap ton of food items done. And I think this would be such a good addition to my market that I have in August. So I will plan out what my first one's gonna be and I'll check back in later. Hello, well, it is the next day, so it's Thursday. Um, I didn't do much crocheting yesterday, but I finished the little fortune cookie. And oh my god, it looks so much better on camera. I was staring at it, I'm like, this doesn't, I don't know if it like looks like a fortune cookie. I was thinking about like twisting it in just a little bit more so it looks like it. So honestly, I might have to take another piece of yarn and like push it in a little bit more, but then it messes with the eyes, I'm not sure. Um, I have not started anything else yet this morning, but I really need to. I don't know why I'm just slacking in the department. I also have to make a reel and share this wrist dress pattern that I made. It's so cute. And then the way that I do it is I actually put both my wrists right here. So it's three parts. So I'm kind of slacking in the posting department as well. I just filmed a reel for this bear on a biscuit <laughs> no focus on this there it goes isn't it so cute i pattern tested this um last week and it just dropped today so i am going to be sharing a reel about it today i just filmed it and i just need to write up the caption so yeah, it's kind of where I'm at. I have to get a lot of content done and I need to crochet. I really want to make um, the Sriracha bottle in it. And do I have black acrylic yarn? I do. Oh, good. I was staring right at it and couldn't even see if I had it. But yeah, so hopefully I can get more done today. I'm just making one of each item, even though I kind of want to make more fortune cookies because this is the cutest thing ever. You put it upside down, it's a frowny face. I love it so much more upside down. That's adorable. Okay, I'm gonna do it tighter so it's like closer, like an actual fortune cookie, and I'm just gonna make it have a frowny face. <laughs> I love that. Um, I think I'm gonna make a sriracha bottle, and I wanna make, I don't remember what it's called, hold on. I definitely wanna make the coconut. Let me get it so that the pattern doesn't show. Look at the coconut. <gasps> it's cute. But that's not what I was going to show you. 
What I'm currently working in in this book is a part of their bento box um, little thing. So I made the little fortune cookie. I just need to close it more. I want to make the sriracha and then I want to make this. They have it. It's called, oh, Danny the Dango. So I think I'm going to make this in the sriracha bottle next. I'll check back in later and hopefully I have them both or at least one done. Good morning. Well, not good morning. It's like 11. Um, we just kind of woke up later, like at around nine. I, I still haven't had coffee yet, but Starbucks is doing that like buy one, get one free thing from like 12 to six. So that's what I'm waiting for. Um, I did finish the dango. I just have to show it shut and make the dango. I just have to sew it shut and make the mouth. I did start on the hot sauce. I just don't have lime green. So I need to go yarn shopping so I can finish that. And then I did, <laughs> I don't even wanna say I started it. I started the soy sauce container, but it's literally just the magic ring and it's just sitting there. I have to, I'm using this today. I love this so much. It's so much easier for typing. Um, I have to fix my Apple doll pattern. And then since the same base for all of my dolls around, I just copied and pasted and just changed like what I needed to for my starfruit doll. So I need to make some changes to the starfruit doll too and contact my testers and send that out to my testers today. Um, I also have to clean, I lost my ring. <laughs> I don't wear it a lot, it's too big. I ended up losing a good amount of weight from when I first got it. Um, when me and my husband got engaged after my pregnancy so it doesn't fit anymore so I don't like wearing it around when I'm doing things because it's loose and going off so I only really try to wear it if, like I'm making videos or if I'm going out of the house um, until we get it resized because I'm deathly afraid of losing it and I did lose it I think it's just on my desk somewhere my desk is just a mess because I like to keep it like on my desk at all times on my jewelry box and it's not on my jewelry box so i really think i just need to clean um and then i have to make like doctor's appointments and everything you know mom things well dentist appointments not doctors they're all good on doctors i just need to time for a cleaning you know um but yeah that's kind of where i'm at i still have to fix my fortune cookie i oh there's pink fuzz on it i want to make it smaller but again angry face <laughs> happy face i love that you just switch it <laughs> um but i'm gonna sew that shirt whenever i finish my dango um just to do all the sewing at once and trying to crochet but yeah um it's friday so i hope everyone has a good weekend and I'll check back in later. We'll see if I go yarn shopping or not. Hello, it's been a minute since I've checked in. It's currently Sunday and I think the last time I checked in was Friday. Um, I don't remember what I showed off everything I got done. So I'll just re-show you. I did a macaroon yesterday. I also finished the dango and added the face. I did a sushi. It's so big. I, oh wait, hold on focus focus there you go i love it i want to make so many of these is there a sushi coaster pattern because i need them i need more coasters for my desk i only have one and it's getting kind of old i need a new one my happy angry fortune cookie i did make the soy sauce bottle and then i need to finish the hot sauce but i still need lime green i have not went yarn shopping um we ended up getting really busy yesterday there was a celebration of my town yesterday they did like fireworks and had a bunch of stuff so i took my girls and we spent majority of the day outside so i didn't get to crochet as much yesterday and today actually i am remaking my doll um this is my start base for my lemon doll i need to take photos and put them throughout my pattern because my testers for my apple doll is due today and i am releasing my pattern tomorrow so by the time this video is out my apple doll pattern is released let me grab it 
my little apple doll. Isn't it so cute? Oh wait, focus. Ah! So she will be released tomorrow. So I do need to take photos because I completely forgot to take it as I was making it. Um, <laughs> so I just need to do that. And then, um, cause I already edited everything. I do need to send it so that they can like revise what I've changed. Cause a lot of them, um, my girl Lori, I love her. Uh, anytime she applies to one of my tester calls, if you see her on it, it's because I need her. She gives me the best feedback. She gives, she literally writes it down on a notebook paper and just labels it from pages and just says everything. She checks my grammar and I was never the best at grammar. So like she is my go-to. She's also testing my starfruit doll that is due the seventh here. So my little starfruit doll, isn't she adorable? I need to work on the lemon and I need to start my mermaid. But, oh my God. I do have a market coming up. Uh, I think it's August 3rd. So, and that's a big one. It's a big annual like art thing that they throw in Niles, Ohio. And I'm gonna be there for like eight hours, six to eight hours, I believe. I'm not sure, I completely forgot about it. And I saw it today as an ad on my Facebook. And I was like, crap, I have a market coming up. So I need to start planning everything that I'm doing and start market prepping as well. So on top of releasing patterns, because I have so many more ideas now, I have um, this whole front page listed down and then like mods for my doll. I wanna make a little hoodie for it, like a little dino hoodie. I think that would be so cute. And yeah, so I'm just kinda, I'm so excited. I also need to take photos of my wrist dress. I have been using this nonstop since I've made it and it has made gaming and typing so much easier. <laughs> my wrists aren't hurting as bad and it like, it feels good, especially when I'm taking a break from crocheting and I'm editing my pattern, and I'm using this. It's, it's like, it feels good. For my wrist so i need to take photos of this i think i want to clean up my desk and take photos of it with my setup and include my big pc because i'm so i love this thing so much my husband bought it for me so gotta gotta show it off um but i also need to put the tester call for up for that so i think i'm gonna do that this upcoming week um because I'm releasing so many patterns back to back. I wanna try and make more free ones to do that. I know a lot of my mods will be free for my dolls. I will never, unless like you like PDF patterns, I could do like a little pack on Etsy of all of my mods for my dolls in like a little bundle that you can buy for like a dollar. It's not gonna be that much just so that I can get like maybe 10 cents out of all of the fees, you know? But yeah, so look out for the tester call for this if you're uh, wanting it and look out for the release of my Apple doll and I'll check back in later if I need to do another update.